Hi, I'm Tori Lux. Um, what makes me queer is uh, I consider myself to be pansexual. I like all genders. And I just love people, individuals. Some, some particular traits and attitudes and looks and things that I find attractive. Um, uh, God, I really, I have, I don't have like a specific type, to be perfectly honest. Like, when someone is just like radiating within, from within themselves, like with being happy with who they are and they're a genuine person, they're genuinely sexual, it's really important, and genuinely uh, trying to pursue like happiness and fulfillment in their life. Like you can tell when someone is that kind of a person. Um, I find that attractive. I mean, I suppose I physically am attracted to uh, people that look a bit more alty, I suppose, but not necessarily. It's about inside. <laughs> what do I love about queer porn? I love the freedom in queer porn that you don't get from mainstream porn. Um, you can just be yourself, and everyone's genuinely sexual and really enjoying the sex. They're not just there for uh, self-promotion, like to get famous or for a paycheck. I feel like um, in terms of ethics and the ethical porn obsession, like I don't feel like it discredits sex workers in uh, mainstream porn. I feel like it's highly subjective. And because um, a lot of mainstream porn, especially the more vanilla porn, I find to be highly misogynistic because the women um, don't seem to be authentically enjoying themselves. But on the same token, a lot of mainstream porn is also really highly sexual and they take care of their performers. It's just, just it's subjective, you know. My favorite thing to do in a scene, it's not a, like a specific sex act necessarily. It's just when I have true chemistry with that person and we have the sparks and the sex is just good mm -hmm. and we can like vibe off each other and enjoy each other. I had unlimited budget and ultimate freedom with aesthetics and everything else. I would probably, well, I have this idea about a porn, uh, about a girl who just moved to a big city from a small town and she's like trying to find her way and she like wanders into like an alley, for example, and ends up like, <laughs> mm, ah, just having like a gangbang with a bunch of people, like she's all innocent and she gets corrupted, like having all this dirty sex with all these people in the big city. And uh, she's kind of like, um, I don't wanna say lethargic, but what's the like, uh, just, I'm very, uh, I don't, I'm trying to, I'm having a hard time articulating what I'm trying to say. <laughs> like, but, it, uh, does, it does sound like a little perverted, like maybe there's a little bit of like consensual non-consent going on. Consensual, like consensual non-consent, exactly. And um, corruption of innocence. I choose to do the work that I do because I've always been highly sexual and I feel that, I feel like doing a normal job would be being untrue to myself and being dishonest with myself and suppressing myself. And I feel like this is the most honest and like the best way that I can be true to myself because it's truly what I want. <laughs> I get, I'm very fulfilled from it. <laughs> I'm very happy to be here and I'm very happy to finally be shooting queer porn and it's something I've wanted to do for a really long time and thanks for having me.